Hello, hello. Today is the day for the vegetables. This is a cauliflower. We're making cauliflower manchurian. I hope many of you have heard of that. So we have pre-blanched cauliflower for one minute. That is the batter. I'll leave the description of what's in the batter. Oil getting nice and hot. My mash or whichever you, whatever you call these. Uh, this part here is a section where is my favorite friend wok is getting its waiting actually. Uh, we need onion for this, so that's one onion. I've got bok choy white that I'm actually say I saved from my uh, uh, other Asian meals or dishes. This is spring onion, capsicum, fresh coriander. Uh, gas sticks sauce. I'll leave the description of what's in the sauce. And there is ginger and there is the garlic. The color of the ginger is because it's marinated. Okay? So you can use fresh, but this is how to say. And there is also, like I said, sauces which I will leave the description below. Let's start. I'll dip cauliflower in. It's better. And I'm going to be taking out nice and hot oil so you can do it in small batches and uh, this one is one of them so i tested oil and it's actually nice and hot so we're gonna be dipping these cauliflower florets in a batches it's bubbling nicely it's gonna be lovely in the meantime, I've got my wok actually heating, so we're gonna start preparing sauce for the cauliflower. So nothing nicer than a nice smell in the kitchen, and a large kitchen, it's heart of the house, isn't it? So nicely getting cold in. So oil is nice and warm, hot, hot. onions are going in. So onions are frying and you also can instead the uh, Spanish onion you can, or if it's red onion you can take the normal white or like a brown onion. So this is a small trick, while I'm frying this I'm going to put a teaspoon of salt because it helps actually onions to soften quicker and without adding water. I usually in my brown onions I add salt and little water. I won't be doing it. So. so two batches of cauliflower are done. Continue with the rest of I won't be probably using all this because it's plenty, but it's just up to you. It's up to you how much you're gonna make. Now I'll add garlic and the ginger. And I'm gonna add carrots. And the beautiful smell that comes from this book is amazing. So, and as you realize, my dishes or my food is mainly made with lots of vegetables. Meat is part of that, but vegetables are essential. That's just meat. I didn't catch it. Beautiful color, beautiful smell, and it's going to be beautiful and gorgeous. Now, bok choy. Sauce. And another sauce. Beautiful caramelizing uh, smell and caramelized color. Be simmering these for five minutes. Lid comes on. So desired amount of the cauliflower is done. Our sauce has taken lovely. And it's very, very, very tasty. So I'll drop it now. Two minutes later, we're gonna add slurry. Mix it. You get nice thickness. Add 
and our sauces. Okay. Now drop all your pieces of uh, cauliflower in this sauce and you're going to give a good mix. And you do that just before you're going to eat. So your cauliflower maturing is done. It's all nicely coated and as I said, do that before uh, coating, you do before you're going to have your uh, meal. Sprinkle with your favorites, spring onion, parsley or coriander. I did coriander. I love my coriander. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you don't find this very hard and I'm looking forward to film another video.